have available. Once you've assessed your site and found your site, you're going to alcohol the site and allow it to air dry. Once the site is dry, you're going to uncap your needle. Be sure that your bevel is up and that you're using a TB syringe with a short bevel. The syringe is at a 5 to 15 degree angle and I'm going to pull the skin taut. This allows you to get between the skin layers. When you inject, you want to be sure the entire bevel is under the skin. Hold the syringe tight and inject forming your nice wheel. Once you've injected all the medication, be sure that you take a nice firm hold on the syringe in order to retract so that your needle does not move. Once you've placed your wheel, then you're going to take your CDC ruler and measure your wheel to make sure it's between 6 to 10, which this one is, is at 10, so that is a, considered a valid test. If it's below 6 or greater than 10 or there's no wheel at all, then it is invalid and you would have to replace the test.